Hey, and welcome back to another week of the Fogo Life. We got something really cool in store for you. Pecania. If you don't know what that is, it's top sirloin. It's got a fat cap on it. Uh, it's called the culotte. It's called all kinds of different things. What I call it is freaking delicious. Josh's premium meats was here and he left this for us. We're gonna throw it on a rotisserie on the Art to Flame grill. We're gonna do it traditional Brazilian style. We're gonna use some coarse salt. That's it. We're gonna spin it on the rotisserie and we're gonna carve it right off of there as if you were sitting in a Brazilian steakhouse yourself, all right? While you got you here, do me a favor, hit subscribe on our channel while you're here. Give us a thumbs up. Tell us that you're liking what you're seeing and share it with your friends, okay? Now let's get this picanha started. We have got our picanha here and we're gonna carve it so that we can put it on here. Now this thing has some unbelievable marbling. It's just gorgeous. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put this on a skewer and rotate it. Now when we cut it, we're gonna carve it off of the skewer. So we wanna make sure we're cutting it the right way. If you're gonna do it like that, you're gonna to wanna to cut it across the grain. In other words, the fibers are running this way, back and forth, straight forward. So we're gonna cut it like this. So let's go ahead and do that. That was fun cutting that. Okay, so we've got our three pieces here. Now, in a traditional Brazilian style, what they do is they cook it on something called a speto. Now, what that is, is a long rod they put it on, it kind of goes into the wall and it just spins on its own. We're gonna do our closest we can that you can do at home too, is on a rotisserie. We're gonna take our rotisserie rod, we're gonna bend these and stick them right through here and let this baby spin. put a good solid coating of salt on here because what that's going to happen is that the salt is going to create a barrier for us that's going to prevent a lot of the juices from dripping out. It's going to form a nice tight crust on that beautiful picanha and it's going to keep all those beautiful juices inside. As you can see our coals are burning nice and hot so we're going to create just a little channel down the middle here so that we don't have the juices dripping right directly down onto the coals. We're going to have two hot beds, one on either side so it's going to cook this nice and evenly from the outside in. Add at the coals already, let's get this baby on the grill. Let's carve this baby. That trimmed up beautifully, so we're gonna put it back on and finish cooking some more. So we're gonna hit it with some more salt and throw it right back on. Oh, 
All trimmed up. It's back on. Finishing up another layer of it. You ready to taste some picanha or what? Let's do it. It looks you amazing. You guys remember Sebastian, right? Hey, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we, we spun this. We covered it with mm -hmm. salt. Spun it. Let's try it. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> wow. 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 <laughs> Wee, that's, that's good. Crazy. Mm. I'm telling you what. Uh, this is oh. out of this world. It's not like any other steak. It's so beefy. It's so tender. It's so chewy. It is just delicious, and it's done perfectly. But it's you know, the fed, the marbling, mm -hmm. it's full of flavor, like incredible flavor. It is. Well, Crazy. You know what they say, fat is flavor, right? And marbling, basically, oh, is fat so veins tender. going through the meat. I'll tell you what. Wow. That Josh has the best pecan in the <laughs> world. This is just absolutely outstanding. I mean, you got to try this. Yeah. I mean, this is a bucket list item, guys. Yep. Hey, listen, it's really good. You, you, you need to try it. If you haven't had it, again, it's called Top Sirloin, Culotte, anything. Remember to give us a subscription. Subscribe to our channel. Give us a thumbs up, please. We love the thumbs up, all right? And don't forget, share it with your friends. So thanks again, and we'll see you next time on The Fogo Life. See you. Bye.